Hi everybody, I have a special announcement to make today. Um, I know a lot of people have been wondering what's going on, is it going to happen, da 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 da, so was I. I was right there with you. Um, but yeah, some things have come through, <laughs> so to speak, have come through. So um, as you can probably guess by the grin on my face, I've got a big surprise. And I am going to show you, take you outside and show you. Yes, it's something that has to be outside. Um, let's just get right to it. Um, close your eyes and I'm going to turn you around and I'm going to show you. Yep. Close your eyes. There it is. That's my new rig. Look how beautiful she is. Um, we got a good price for her. We had a heck of a day yesterday. I will tell you all about it. But right now, I just want to show you the inside. So let's go look at the inside. I had the air on for a while so I could turn it off so I can talk to you without sweltering in there. But uh, yeah, it's a Class C, 24 foot, has one slide out. Um, Let's see here. Let's go in. This is what it's like going in. Oh, nice and cool in here. Let me grab the door. Oh, my husband's going to call me in a little bit. Supposed to order some food. He's going to pick it up. I probably should have waited. Well, he said 15 minutes. Uh, all righty. Um, yes, here it is. It's beautiful. Yes, here is the front. Um, very clean it still has the plastic on the bottom the man who owned it took really good care of it he kept it in a storage area and a storage shed it has 32,000 miles on it it has a slide out as you can see right here is a slide out even has this the safety plastic still on the carpet from um he's just kept it there which is probably not a bad idea i just might get some throw rugs and put it there I don't know we'll see how that works out <laughs> but uh there's a couch that goes into a bed and this is where my bed's going to be it's going to be up here i'm going to get a, a mattress um, a memory foam mattress and my husband's going to build me a thing out of wood that goes all the way down there it might be about uh, maybe this high you know uh i don't know uh half a foot high or half a yardstick high or lower than I don't know I don't know measurements sorry but you'll see it'll go all the way down there and I have a little tabletop on the over here for my CPAP machine and then this here will have little cubbies I can put you know my bottled water my sleeping pills my bug bed uh, bear spray at night you know little miscellaneous and also good for some storage um, it has a TV came with the TV see he was into the plastic wrap he, has the plastic wrap still on the TV nice cupboard in there comes with the DVD player it's got the shield for the um, the uh, front window I'm gonna take these curtains off and replace it with something else uh, let's see uh, here's your dining room the dining room table um, a lot of these lights are burnt out. We have to get new bulbs, so there's not really much light in here at the moment. Um, nice little, there's storage under here. This very comfortable, nice window there. Got storage up here, over here. I got storage above the couch. I got storage. This will be my, my clothes here. Um, you know, I'll be storing a lot of stuff in there. I'm going to do some kind of plastic shelving in here or... Um, drawers type things I don't know we'll figure it out and I got three drawers here um, nice size refrigerator anyway yeah it's still cold I have storage up here me being so short this will be I will use this for um, ooh, excuse me uh, for um, extra things that I don't need very often look at the kitchen isn't this just gorgeous look at all the cupboard space in the kitchen oh down here this is a convection oven and microwave um, we got two fantastic fans one in the bathroom and one out here um, the kitchen is in the back 
here's all my generator stuff which I have to learn I have so much to learn my friends and uh, yeah let me show you the bathroom the bathroom is a nice size too I like how I like the size of everything it's just you know it's look at the storage in here it's just massive storage that was one thing I was really looking for was some storage um, nice bathtub and shower um, he he hasn't used it in a year and a half he's got he's an older gentleman and um, so when he put this away he all the septic stuff was cleaned so I'm going to get a compost toilet and then since it hasn't been used we're not going to use it and I said that that part is already done we don't have to do that part we can just install the toilet so yeah so that's some of the upgrades that I'm going to make. I'm going to make a few upgrades. There's a few things that have to be, um, which we knew we bought it, that have to be dealt with. And one of the things is the slide out bracket on the corner over here. He's got it undone right now so we can have the slide out. We have a um, repair, RV repair shop, right, actually right across the street. And um, we're going to send it over there and have them fix it. They're good about that. And to get you know just get it done and be done with it but uh, little storage over the door you know once I get my little personal touch onto everything yesterday um, we went to go look at one yesterday which was about two and a half hours west from where I live and um, it was a piece of junk we were there two minutes and left and then I this one I saw but on Craigslist it said um, Orlando so when I called her and she gave me the address, you know, saying Davy Boulevard, I'm like, I hung up and I said, I don't think she's in Orlando. We tried it there, couldn't find nothing in Orlando. And then we tried it in, in Fort Lauderdale. And then I called her back. I said, are you in Fort Lauderdale? <laughs> she's like, yeah. I said, well, I'm not an hour away. Cause I called, I'll be there in an hour. You know, I said, well, I'm not an hour away. I says, you know, we're not going to come and look at it. She's like, you, you really should it's a good you know I know you've been looking a lot you know I'm not trying to sell it tell it to you or anything but I'm just letting you know it is a good deal I said oh I know it is it's just that I don't know but you know and I said my husband and he's like we can go down there if you want you know and I was like are you sure <laughs> and so we drove for almost four hours just to get there uh, and then we got there and that's when she discovered the little corner thing wasn't working right. And she was going to get the guy to come fix it. But he was real busy. He wasn't going to come to 6, 7 o'clock at night. And God knows how long that was going to take to fix. So we weren't having that. So he just, we just fixed it up, bungee cord that end on, and drove home. And then on the way home, <laughs> the headlight switch goes bonkers. So he can only, he has to hold it on high. There's, a, there's something in the... Um, uh, ignition or in the not an ignition in the switch there and once it goes and gets fixed that thing get there gets fixed we're sending it to the mechanic and he is going to do the whole nine shabooms on it which it's well maintained but I like to know where it's where I'm starting with I want the belts checked because it has sat for a year and a half you know we're going to have the um, transmission um, looked at and but it's a 2005 um, 24 foot uh, oh I thought that was my air making that noise he's weed whacking over there I'm like oh no not something else you know you know whenever you buy anything used you know you know what you're getting into and that's fine and I knew that when I was getting into this and she did not pass it off like it was perfect you know and um but as far as the outside, inside, and the engine has been very well kept. It's got 39,000 miles on it when we got it. Now it's got 40,000 <laughs> because we drove home. So it's got 40,000 miles on it. It's a 2005. Um, it's just, uh, I, I wanted it. I wanted this because let me tell you, my friends, I have been looking. And I just hadn't put them on because... I either they were just ridiculously priced, couldn't afford it, or they were junk. And it's hot. So when you're out there looking at stuff, I'm not thinking, and that's just me, I'm like, oh, you know what, they'll see it when I buy it. 
because I just can't deal with this heat. And it's it was hot yesterday in Fort Lauderdale. I couldn't believe it. I was like, my God. I used to live there when I was about eight or nine, and it was hot. <laughs> I was, we all was sweating. Oh, I couldn't wait to get home. Took a shower. I didn't even eat dinner. We got home about 10, 10, 30. I took, my stomach was growling when I went to bed. And I said, I don't care. I'm too tired. <laughs> I woke up so hungry this morning. But yes, we're going to start this new adventure very, very soon. Um, um, my leave date is going to be for September 1st. That's what I'm going to try to um, leave. I want to get everything. You know, I got a pack in here. I got. I haven't even done any of that. I got to clean it all first. I'm gonna wipe everything down and clean it all up before I even bring anything in here. Um. Yeah, but I will be bringing you along as I do this. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be. I am so excited about this new adventure that. Oh, and by the way, I have not even drove it yet. I have not even drove it yet, but I know I, I have tri test drive plenty of them and I know I can drive it, so it's not like I don't know how. I have to learn. See, when you buy something from a dealership, they show you everything. We're on our own. We do have the manuals and stuff and we're looking at it and I will be looking at YouTubes and if anybody out there has any tips about anything, the water, the generator, the how in the world does this thing back here work? I have no idea how this thing works or what we're, you know, nothing's lit up on it. I, you know, I don't know. I don't know what's, I don't know if this is, this should be on this, I, you know, I don't know. So this is stuff we're going to have to look into. And so, um, is there a special button you put on? I mean, that says off for the hot water, the level test. Levels to oh I see oh hey look at we're figuring it out together oh 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 yeah I'm gonna have to watch a lot of videos <laughs> all right see I am a self learner anyway so I am not intimidated by it or anything like that because I know I will figure it out. When, I, when there's something I'm interested in, I will search it, read it, and get very knowledgeable about, about it. I won't say I know everything, because I will never say I know everything. I don't care how much research, because you always learn new things. Look, you can see my eyes. I, am, I have been so stressed, so tired. This last week has been crazy with personal stuff and business stuff. It's just... Whew, and I know they keep telling me it's the, it's the eclipse with the retrograde. You ain't kidding. And I'm a Gemini and I can feel it. I feel it. And it's, I'm just doing everything I can to keep my wits about myself, you know? Ah, that's why I, I took a nap. I was being all snappy today. I said, I told DJ, I said, I gotta go take a nap or I'm gonna be just a bear by the end of the day. I said, I'm so Sorry exhausted. That. My phone shut off in there. I don't know why. Uh, I'm, that's why I'm, I'm taping on my phone because I did tape some stuff on my camera and I'm trying to learn this new software and um, I'm not having much luck and like I said the last couple weeks have been off the chain um, so I'm not really going to worry about it until I get out there you know I'm putting too much pressure on myself I'll start freaking out uh, yeah I am so tired I am so tired um, I'm going to go, I want to put this video up because I want everybody to let everybody know and I'm going to be on the road soon and I can't wait to see people that I've talked to and I'm just so overwhelmed, All right, I'm just so overwhelmed, I just, you know, I'm just, I can't believe it's actually happening, I keep pinching myself, you know, ugh. I gotta go because I'm now I'm rambling. <laughs> I get overtired and overstressed. I my I really shouldn't do anything because I make big mistakes when I make decisions. I don't make any decisions or anything like that. Oh, I gotta go. My husband's calling.